Hi old folks, so today we're gonna learn, you know these QR code things, right? You know what these are? For those of you Android dummies, these are basically uh, codes, it's like barcode that you can read. It's basically a 3D barcode you can read, or 2D if you want to call it. So there's a bunch of apps you can get for free on the market. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to market and go type you can type QR code or barcode. I like getting the barcode app because it does both um, regular barcode and also QR code. So let's go and search for barcode. Barcode scanner. And my favorite app for this is actually just the barcode scanner by Z Zing Team. I think they're Chinese. <laughs> they must be. Anyway. Click there. You can get, you try other ones too, but I like this one because I've been using it for a while. And then uh, install it. And then let's go. Let's go read my QR code. Just take a second. You gotta hold it pretty steady. Oh, right on. Ah, why is it taking forever now? Ah, demo fail. Oops. Okay, I'm not sure why it's not working. Should work now. There you go. What? No, 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 no. I think I got it wrong here. Hold on, let me adjust the camera so you can see it better. Oh, there you go. See that? Got all my information. Look at that. How cool is that, right? I think this app has actually a bug in it. So I... Oh, so look at all this information I put on my my um my QR code. It has all my, you know, personal contact and all my websites. You can put up to I think like like 255 characters or something. You can go type on Google if you want to make your own QR code. Just type QR code generator on Google and then you can blow it up in Photoshop and make a QR code like I did here and I even have a QR code uh, t-shirts which is cool anyway that's how you read a QR code with your uh, Android smartphone um, now you can go read all those QR codes so see y'all later